Hey guys, welcome to the channel. It's uh, Rad from Radko Tarot. And uh, in this whole video, we're going to look into Cancer Sun, Cancer Moon, and as well uh, Cancer Rising Weekly General Tarot reading February 7th up until February 13th, uh, 2022nd. And uh, should you wish uh, to skip this draw, guys, and you want to move right away to the spread, you can definitely do that by using the timestamp in the description down below. Uh, other than that, if you do enjoy uh, the content here on the channel and uh, you do wish to support us, just leave a like subscribe hit that notification bell so you do not miss any of our weekly uploads nor any live streams as well and uh with that said let's make the draw shall we so with the first one that stands as the lovers it does look like that the week is going to start really really well for you uh the second card we have a 10 of pentacles followed by the third card which is the king of pentacles uh, moving next, we have uh, the Nine of Pentacles. And the final card for you is going to be Two of Cups. That's that's fantastic. It's great. Uh, I do want to draw one more card for the King of Pentacles, just so I will be able to tell you a little bit more about this individual and their purpose into uh, your week. And the card for them is going to be the seven, uh, the seven of swords, like that. Passive enemies is what we do have as an elemental dignity. So that's going to do it for the draw. Let's jump right away into the uh, into the spread. Alright, Cancer, so you can see your uh, spread on the screen here. And right off the bat, guys, you are going to have a lot from everything for what it seems from the week. The week is great for you, for progress, career, relationship also. Uh, as you can see here at the end of the week, uh, should you be looking for love, uh, maybe your luck and your chance is going to open up. Regardless if you are single or not, I mean, these two cards, the Nine of Pentacles and the Two of Cups as a follow-up, kind of speaks for a very, very deep dive into the... Um, into the fields and as well the realms should i say of a uh, romantic endeavor the only concern that you may have for throughout the week it is with this person that we do have over here i'm going to talk a little bit more about that individual later on but what i can tell you right now it is that this person will act from a with a selfish reasons although that is not their typical nature now other than that uh you are starting up very strong the week with uh, the lover's card because that kind of speaks that whatever you are facing right now uh in your career or into your relationship is going to start becoming more harmonious on its own accord and it is on the on its own accord and it's going to feel that way but the real reason why that is going to happen for you it is because at this stage of the week the very start you are going to take some right decisions Actually, there will be no right or wrong decisions, but you are going to make some decisions about your career, about your love life as well. And that is going to throw everything into harmony through which um, concerns and issues that you may be facing at that stage, they are simply going to... Um, how can I put it into words? They are going to start resolving themselves on their own accords, and that may be the point where you may meet your new suitor that we can see development at the end of the week as well but here at the start should you meet should you meet your suitor at the start of the week you need to know that the meeting is going to leave to be a little bit underwhelming uh, it's not that there there isn't going to be any attraction whatsoever but it is because through that attraction you are to see that you are very very different from one another in fact it will be a struggle to find a common ground like a common topic to talk about hobby to share and so on and so forth but quickly you both are going to grow to see that you can learn a great deal from one another and in fact that diversity it is what you need and that these differences are simply making you special for one another but after but the result of this, of this harmony is going to be the ten of pentacles 
where you're pretty much gonna have everything set up or how do I put it into words? Everything sorted out, maybe. Because with the Ten of Pentacles, that speaks that adds uh, from the start to the middle of the week, you're going to feel very comfortable career-wise, relationship-wise as well. And also, you're not going to have any strings, which kind of speaks that should you have any dependencies at that stage or up until that stage, it's highly likely that you will go out of those dependencies and you will kind of like gain more personal freedom from your family friends maybe uh services that you are providing i don't know uh, uh promises that you gave and so on and so forth uh, loans that you will have to repay mortgages etc etc it's just through the harmony should you face any problems paying your mortgage uh, your rent uh it's highly likely that these problems are going to be resolved on their own accord like i said or it's, it's how it's going to feel however the true resolution comes from that you have made some decisions that may look unimportant, but they are important. For the Ten of Pentacles, I can say also that you may have some bumps here and there with people from your past, not necessarily ex-lovers, okay? They could be uh, friends you haven't saw from a very, very long time, relatives that you haven't heard, or heard from for a very, very long time, and now the connection is kind of like regained. Now, what is um, common for the Ten of Pentacles It is that this relationship ended up on the wrong foot and uh, now there is a chance that this thing can be meant. It is entirely up to, up to you though to decide do you want to mend that connection or not. And right where the things are really going great for you, career-wise, relationship-wise, what I forgot to mention for the Ten of Pentacles, it is that should you should you have any ideas or rather like any plans to make investments from the start to the middle of the week, uh, according to the Ten of Pentacles, those investments, all of them are going to be profitable, whether it is emotional investments or material investments. But right on the peak of your experience here, this individual, the king of... Uh, pentacles shows up and uh it pains me to say but because that person at least according to these cards that i see here it is in a dire need uh, by their nature they are not selfish by a large margin they're actually very very uh, generous not charitable okay they always expect their generosity to be returned but they are very generous usually very self-absorbed and also uh, how can I put it into words? Established, also very established. I mean, it's likely that they have a very good job or a business, happy family and so on and so forth. But something is threatening their domain. And so they can, how can I put it into words? Sustain their domain. They have to act selfish, which is out of their character. Now, while it is good to help okay help it's it's always something good that that, that that the person should do sometimes that help deprives you of things uh, and we are not martyrs I, I don't know how to explain it what my point here is for you cancer it is that should at the middle of the week somebody comes to you for for a favor or asking for help which help is going to deprive you of great things you need to know that uh, this request is born from a selfish reasons. According to these cards, there is nothing for you to gain off from it. So if you can part ways with whatever resources you are asked from, that's great. I mean, you should you should definitely help. But if it is that you have to take away from the meal of your children to give to somebody else, then I don't know. I cannot I cannot advocate for that. Okay. So my point here is just be very, very mindful how much resources you spend for no return. Because there will be no return according to these cards. But fast forward after the deal with this person whether you decide to help them or not afterwards from the mid to the end of the week things are going to be very very easy going for you and by the way with the nine of pentacles that we have here okay 
uh, it's highly likely that you are to be addressed with a huge leap into development is how this card stands usually this card is considered as the DOD project the job the person for example and that's why the uh, romance here or rather like the flirting with the uh, with the lovers card could lead to the realization that yeah we are different but we are getting along very well I mean that's the woman or that's the guy and from there with the two of pentacles at the end the love in between you two really thrives but even if it is a, about a business venture with the two of cups at the end you need to know that all the partnership that this business venture is going to offer you with are going to be benign they are going to be very thriving they are going to be very profitable for you and uh, <clears throat> If not love, the Two of Cups, it is where you do end up the week in a very friendly environment. I don't know how to explain it. Yeah, it's a friendly environment where, you know, everybody which is around you is going to wish you all the best. And you are to see no uh, opposition or rather like interference, a, uh, a, a nefarious inf interference from the people around you within your own deeds the end of the week is going to be an end where there will be no shyness there will be no pride and all the connections and relationships you have should unfold and develop to the next stage from there on moving forward but your true growth kind of starts from the midst to the end of the week where you are going to make that huge leap into development and it's going to look like a piece of cake it's not going to be something that you're going to break a sweat over it even so with that being said cancer uh this was your weekly general tarot reading guys hopefully you do enjoy it and you do liked it and we are to see each other next time until then bye